The journey to Sogakope has not always been a smooth one for Accra Hata folk. In their last five visits here, the Phobians have lost each time, including an infamous 5 0 thrashing in 2017. An aggregate defeat of 11 0 in three games. It was therefore not surprising to see some Hearts of Folk fans give up even before kickoff. I'm a Hearts fan, but you know they perform. For some, though, in typical representation of the club's never say die mantra, we're quietly optimistic. I know why you're here, but I'm telling you, today will be a different day for I'm not promising, but we are going to Wafa. We are not coming back um, with zero points. For the Wafa fans, it was celebration as usual. With only one result in mind, another routine win against the Phobians. At kickoff, House of Oak dominated from start to finish. It's a game the Phobians should have won, but put the result in context, and a draw here is worth more than three points for every member of the Oak Tree. The celebrations post-game were evidence of that. This was deemed a mission impossible, but House of Folk came, they saw, and they almost conquered. A nil-nil draw deserves celebration, and rightly so, because House of Folk have not secured a point here in five years. But today, they came. Edward Odom, the head coach, giving debut to two players, Nate, one of them, absolute beast performance from him to secure them that particular point. House of Folk will see this as victory. For Wafa, it will be a disappointing result because the record against Heart of Folk in the past has been stellar. Next up for the Phobians is a trip to the Liberty Park in Dansuman, where they'll be hoping the confidence achieved from this game will push them further forward in the table. From the Wafa Park in Sogakope, I'm Fentio Tahiro Fentio for City Sports.